No, it's definitely enjoyable. Mm-hmm. It's a one well worth a watch for mm-hmm. sure. And if you're afraid of horror, I don't know that I would use that as a detractor because mm-hmm. is it technically horror? Yeah, but I don't think it's really deep into the horror genre. And so, well, I mean, it's things... not like, I mean, what is it about horror you don't like? That's probably the better question to ask. Like, is it like scare, jump scares, like horrific, like bloody scenes and whatnot? Um, there is a few bloody scenes in this movie. So like, sure. <laughs> you can't say there's none. There's a few. There are some fight scenes. There is a finger cut off at one scene. Um, there's like, yeah. there are like, someone does commit out, suicide. And someone does commit suicide. Though it happens off screen. You just see right. afterwards the body hanging from the rafters. But, uh, so yeah, it just like, it, it depends what you're into. Like what you, what part of horror you don't like. So I would say it's more of a yeah. thriller. But there is some bloody scenes in it, and there are some disturbing elements. So yeah, take a lot of the that. the disturbing things I found were more psychological. So yeah. you won't be the biggest surprise, honestly, is Jeremy shooting himself, which you kind of see coming, honestly. So mm-hmm. it's not because they they build up to it in the you know two minutes leading to the gun in his mouth. 